Hi guys, so welcome back to another vlog. Today is Monday and it is time to prep for vacation. I leave on Wednesday and I have so many things to do, it's not even funny. And I always tell myself I'm gonna give myself enough time, I'm not gonna procrastinate and here I am once again. I did just got done filming a video though and I already have a stain on my shirt. I have makeup on my sweater, love that for me. Doing a wear test though on this new makeup that I'm trying out from e.l.f. So I'm gonna wrap that video up later on, but in the meantime, I figured I would start packing because I just opened up a bunch of my Amazon packages. So I wanna go through, try some stuff on and kind of figure out what I'm bringing with me and just start getting my outfits together. And then I also have to go to Target. I also need to get a pedicure. I have to edit. I have just a bunch of other things to do, but let's try on some of these clothes first from Amazon and I'll show you guys some stuff that I got. First thing, these are one of my most repurchased things from Amazon, the Tinkle Eyebrow Razors. Love these. I shave my face usually once or twice a month. I also got this cute little bag. Isn't it adorable? I'm definitely gonna bring this with me. It's so pretty. Okay, love. Three piece swim set. Look at this pattern. This is so pretty, this print. I love all of the colors too. So this is like a little kind of dress cover up and then it is just the standard bikini. This I know is gonna fit. I've ordered bathing suits from Amazon before. I'm actually gonna bring a couple that I have from last year. This three piece set is everything. I'm not gonna show you guys the full thing because I don't wanna get censored because it is kind of a bit much. This is also really comfortable. I mean, the bra I will say, if you have bigger boobs, this is probably not gonna do much for you, but the bottoms are really nice. And then this cover up, 10 out of 10 it's so comfortable it fits like a little really tight mini dress so this is definitely coming with me i just tried on two other bathing suits so this one i love the color i actually like the way it fits it's just a little bit too tight so i feel like it runs a little bit small i'm obsessed with this i actually want to return and get a bigger size because i really like it so the color is my fave it's a pretty sage green but you get the little skirt here which is really stretchy and i love this material, I think it's so flattering. Then the bottoms. It's more so the bottoms that are a little bit too tight on me. The tops actually, it's not bad. But again, if you have big boobs, this is not really gonna do much for you. Another one that I'm really sad about, this one also I think runs a little bit small. So it's like the top fits, but the bottoms are small for me. But it's a really gorgeous lavender shade. And the top, I actually like it because it goes like this. I like the little thing in the middle, the detail. It's just like a good, top i actually really like this i was debating keeping this just for the top but i don't have a bottom to go with it i'm gonna bring the first one that i showed you guys i'm also bringing this little yellow bathing suit i actually got this at walmart and i just washed it but it's so pretty i love the yellow with the little brown detailing it's perfect for summer and this actually fits really nicely so this is a medium it's from the brand no boundaries and then this is another bathing suit that i'm gonna bring it's so flattering it has a very low v cut and then the sides are pretty exposed, so you're gonna have a little bit of a side boob peeking through, but I love it. Another Amazon bathing suit, this little zebra print one is coming with me as well. I like the bottoms, but I'm gonna bring another pair of bottoms just in case, because I feel like they're more comfortable. These are just black high-waisted bottoms. I got these at Target a few years ago. I also got another purse. This brand from Amazon makes the most gorgeous bags. They're such good quality. I have two other ones, so I wanted to get this little green one for spring and summer. I'm loving green these days. And this one is green and silver. I have a lot of gold, but I also do like silver. But this is so pretty. It's just very simple. I love that you get the little bag with it too to store it away. Now everything else that I got are workout things, but I want to try them on real quick. Look at this gorgeous color. It's the most perfect blue. I've heard really good things about these leggings, so I wanted to try them out for myself. They feel super soft. Let me try them on. Okay, so this little jacket moment, love it. I feel like it just cinches you in and it hugs the body quickly. And then these leggings are so stretchy and comfortable. It's insane. Also got this in purple, which I like. The sleeves are a little bit long for me. I'm pretty short. I'm only like 5'3", so things tend to be a little bit longer on me like this, but it's still so cute. I'm just, I can't get over these leggings and this blue. I don't have any color like this. Okay, these leggings are just doing it for me. These are black, super stretchy. They feel like the blue ones, honestly. I think the brand is a little bit different, but they feel really nice. I love. I'm usually a medium in all leggings on Amazon and they always fit like a glove. Okay, the leggings that I just showed you guys, the black ones, I'm still wearing them right now. Love them. The way that they feel, they're just like butter and they're very stretchy. So I actually got them in this green color as well. Comparing them to the first blue ones that I tried on, these feel a little bit thicker 
and they're also very stretchy but i feel like these are a little bit more stretchy the ones that i have on right now also got this from amazon Eh, the material is okay. It's honestly pretty thin. You could probably get something much better quality somewhere else. This is the last clothing piece that I got from Amazon. This is just a little hoodie, a cropped hoodie. This I love. It's definitely pretty big. Again, with the arms, my arms are so short, so stuff is a little bit big, but it's cozy. It is cropped, but it's not too cropped. The material is thicker. This, and I really, really like it. Compared to the one that I just showed you guys, a little cropped sweater, this is 20 times better as far as the quality. It's, it's thick. And I love this color too, keeping. I actually did get one more thing. I got a dress. I have a feeling this is gonna fit. And if it does, I'm definitely gonna bring this with me. This would be perfect for just being on the beach. This is the dress, love it. It, it doesn't go all the way down. It stops right above my ankle, but very comfortable. I like this little sweetheart line that it has too, because it doesn't feel like it's gonna slide down like i'm not going to constantly have to be pulling it up which is nice and it's black i mean you really just cannot go wrong with a little black dress now i'm going to pick some other things to take i definitely want to get some sandals when i go to target though and i put this little cover up on to see if i want to bring it or not i was looking for another one that i had and i have no idea where it is so i might just end up bringing this because it's just classic and it goes over any bathing suit. I'm definitely bringing this black dress. And then I'm also going to bring this little green dress. Because I have the perfect earrings to go with this. If you guys watched my last vlog, then you know. But I'm going to bring this. I don't want to go too crazy. Because this is not a super long trip. So I don't need 15 outfits. But, you know, I start thinking about, okay, dinner outfit. And then daytime outfit. And then that's when my overpacking starts. For during the day, I typically really like to wear jean shorts because you can just throw these over your bathing suit and call it a day and you have a little outfit and bring a little cover up and these are levi's so they're gonna last you forever and they're gonna go with everything do i want to bring a pair of jeans maybe do i need a pair of jeans i'm gonna bring these from abercrombie they're the 70s vintage flare ultra high rise it's a nice light wash so i think i'll bring these with a cute top okay so jean shorts a good pair of jeans I got two dresses. Honestly, I really don't even need much more to pack. Maybe like a couple cute tops and I should call it a day. I need to not overpack because I am ridiculous. The amount of outfits that I usually don't even end up wearing. Go. But I'm like a just in case kind of person. And don't even get me started when it comes to underwear. Hector always laughs at me because I bring like 20 pairs of underwear, even if it's like a three day trip, like because you just never know. And my absolute favorite, and let me just actually do that now since I'm here. I usually just grab like a bunch, a handful of underwear whenever I travel because you just that you never know and you can never have too many underwear. Favorite underwear ever thongs, skims, you cannot go wrong. They're so comfortable, it doesn't even feel like you're wearing a thong. Definitely gonna bring a couple of these. I actually just got this color, but they're so stretchy. I mean, the stretch to these is insane and they're so comfortable. They're seamless. I wear them all the time. The only time I'm not wearing a thong are the first two days of my period, but other than that, I'm always in a thong because it's just so comfy. So, yeah, I'm gonna just bring a couple different pairs. Of undies oh yeah the thongs that i got from tj maxx if you guys watched my last video they're really comfortable too they're really soft definitely not like skims the material is not identical but they, they're nice i also really like these little bandeaus whenever i'm like traveling or wearing certain shirts where like for instance this dress this honestly i could probably get away with wearing no bra but these little bandeaus are nice because they have some padding in them but they're good under clothes but i think i'm gonna bring one of these and then my strapless bra and then i have this little strapless bra from target it's not really my favorite i'm still on the hunt for the perfect strapless bra but i mean it works it gets the job done so this is what i'm bringing i have another little black dress here this one is different than the one that i'm wearing this one's shorter and it has straps. I'm like, should I just bring this one and keep this one for another time? Since I already have a long green dress, maybe I'll bring the short black dress so that's kind of different. Okay, I'll do that instead. And this I actually got from Ross. I already wore this a couple times. I love little black dresses. You can do so much with them. Just try it on this top with the jeans that I'm gonna bring, and I love it. I'm gonna bring this. And this could be a little outfit. This with jeans and like some sandals. This top specifically. It's from Classy Network. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them. I discovered them on TikTok. But they have a built-in bra in all of their shirts. So you don't even have to worry about a bra or anything. But yeah, I'm going to bring this top. Instead of the cover-up that I had on, I'm actually going to bring this white button-up that I got from Amazon. It's a little bit longer in the back. I usually wear it as a shirt. It's just a simple button-up. You know, you could do a lot with it. But I'm going to wear it as a cover-up too because the back is a little bit longer. Target. 
today's coffee. Let's do it. So this is everything I have in my cart so far. I'm thinking about which bathing suit to get. I don't know. I know I don't need both, but I do really like this one because it's a little bit more of a push-up style and it's my size. I always like to get a pair of flip-flops. I just got some white ones. And then I also got these sandals. I figured I would just get a black and a cream pair because I can kind of mix and match and wear these with different outfits. But they actually have some really pretty colors. I love the orange ones. Those are fun. And they have some tan ones right here these are pretty with the pearls it's giving like kind of bridal vibes and i'm here for it i also have these sandals here which i like too i was debating getting those orange ones because i love them for a little pop of color so i just ended up getting a new top i actually just found this and it's super cute it's from wild fable and then i got some other little toiletries stocked up on my favorite mouthwash hey guys so i had a really productive day today i got a video done i have to still finish editing today but i'm gonna do that later on once i'm all finished packing i'm here at the nail salon right now i'm gonna get a pedicure i'm so happy they're open i actually came yesterday and it was closed and i didn't know it was closed Somebody's walking in. Okay, I'm gonna get in there, get my pedicure, come back, finish packing, editing. Probably gonna pull an all-nighter tonight because we have to leave around three. And so I'm the type of person, like, when I have so much to do, I'm like, why sleep for three, four hours? Like, I might as well just get some stuff done and I can sleep on the plane. Meanwhile, Hector is the complete opposite. He's like, even if I have to sleep two hours, I will get my rest in, which is good, but my mind doesn't always work that way. I got one of the best pedicures, you guys. I am so happy. I feel like a new woman. And I got baby pink on my toes. I usually alternate between French, white, or baby pink. Also picked up sushi. I'm about to eat right now. And then I'm gonna just go into packing mode, wrap everything up. So this is the sushi. I got a romantic roll. When I'm really hungry, I will get two of these and an order of spring rolls. But today I just got one. I'm not starving, but I'm hungry. So this romantic roll is shrimp, Crab meat, avocado, green beans, or is it asparagus? One of those, and it's so good. There's like sauce on it, and it is delish. Look at that, it's so good. The camera's like really zoomed in, by the way. I used to have a lens that attached to it to make it like wide angle, and it would always fall, and that's what happened last time. The whole entire lens came off, and the whole camera fell, and that's how my camera broke. So I just took it off, and that's why it's like super zoomed in. Anyways, cheers. I just can't wait to officially be done with packing and everything. Packing is always the most stressful thing because I always feel like I'm forgetting something. I love duck sauce with spring rolls and I love that you get two spring rolls in one every time. From everywhere that you get a spring roll, you always get two. It's it's the best. I just gave Bernard a cookie. That's what, if you hear little sounds in the back, that's him. He wants my food, of course. He's gonna start pouting in a minute. Bernardo, I just gave you a snack. I love you. You're so crazy. And the fortune of the day is a good one. Go after what you want. There's no time like the present. Very true. Let's pack some toiletries. Starting off with my makeup brushes, I'm actually gonna put them in here in this bag and I have them in this brush cup from Anissa Beauty because typically all of my brushes get squished when I travel. So this is so much easier and more convenient. And then I'm just gonna put other toiletries around and I have another bag too where I'm gonna put my skincare, but let's do the toiletries first. I also love bringing my skincare sleeves every time I travel. These are the best. That way the water doesn't run down your arms. So I'm just gonna put these actually on the bottom here. Main reason for that is because I have this little glass cleanser from Youth to the People. This is my favorite. I use this every single night. Got these little minis from Sol de Janeiro at Sephora. It comes with a little spray, a Brazilian bum bum cream, and a shower gel. Everything mini is just so much cuter. Deodorant, always a must. Also got these little mini Desi skins. They're so adorable. First is the Do Me Over spray. This is really hydrating. The Claro Que si Vitamin C Serum, one of my favorites. I actually have the big size over here. I love it. And this I've actually never tried. It's the Mask On Overnight Moisture Mask. My skin does get really dry. It's actually flaking right now on my nose. So I'm definitely gonna try this out. And then this is just a little gel cream moisturizer. This also I have never tried. Bar of soap and lip balm from Pixi. In this little pocket here, I'm gonna put some floss. My razor from Harry's. I love these bags. I feel like you can fit such a good amount of products in here. Also wanted to mention the Desi Skin Goodies actually came in this little bag. I'm actually using this for my tampons, pads, just in case I get my period. I also have a little heating patch back there, some Midol, and some motion sickness pills. 
but I actually have this leftover bottle from the last time that I traveled and this is just some leave-in conditioning spray from Eva NYC. I love this 10 in 1. It smells so good. I got a mini shave gel. This is the same brand of razors that I love. Toothpaste, of course. I always like to bring a cleansing balm whenever I travel to remove makeup because it's so much easier than a liquid makeup remover. And this one from e.l.f. is really good. I'm going to put our toothbrushes in here as well. I'm going to bring two little containers of mouthwash and I'm going to fill this up with the Eva NYC 10 in 1 shampoo. I actually wish I would have bought shampoo, but I honestly forgot. I'm also going to bring one of my current favorite eye creams, the Honest Calm and Renew Melting Eye Balm. So hydrating. I love this in the morning and at night. And I'm going to bring some SPF. The Super Goop Glow Screen has actually been one of my go-tos and hopefully I can get away with bringing this, but I love the Honest Beauty Hydrogel Cream and I don't even have that much left in here, but I'm just going to bring whatever is left and use this up. I'm obsessed with this moisturizer. I kind of want to bring a refill, but I don't want them to throw it out. So if anything, I'll just bring this because it doesn't have a ton, but I also have the Desi Skin moisturizer, so I should be good, hopefully. I'm also going to bring this little mini rose water. And then I just have me and Hector's washcloths. And we're done, officially with the toiletries. And I'm about to switch out my bag. I have this one here from Aldo. I got this at Ross or TJ Maxx years ago, but it's still one of my favorites. I've used this thing up, but I especially do like it when I travel because it is bigger and I want to put my camera and all of my other stuff in here. Hand sanitizer, of course. I also have my little cuticle oil pen from Happy Cuticle. These are the best. If you do not have one of these in your purse, add one right now. I should actually use some too, but she has so many great scents and they're so affordable. Hair tie, of course. My passport. I also have this little bag of lippies and eye drops my lumify eye drops are the best hand cream and these little purell wipes which are always nice to have and then i have this bag with some electronics and camera stuff i'll end up putting my camera there as well and maybe a couple other things but yeah everything fits in here too i tried it that's why i love this bag i need to get an updated version because this is really old almost forgot to mention two very important things in my bag mints and perfume of course and i also just packed my jewelry i just got a bigger jewelry box and i'm so happy because i can fit more and it just it's much better i have a little mini one that i do like but i want to have some variety and so i have just kind of like my everyday jewelry and i also have some other things right under here my bracelets some more necklaces so this is also probably going to go in my carry-on shout out to rare beauty for sending these over i love to travel with this bag so i'm going to put one bag of toiletries here hector will probably put another bag of toiletries in his bag and then i just pretty much have to put makeup and i'm also bringing my laptop and charger now i am officially all done with packing the makeup was the last thing and i really like these ally glines makeup bags i usually keep all of my brow and eye products in the smaller one and i have no idea if i'm gonna use any of this because honestly whenever i have traveled in the past i don't always wear makeup especially when it's just us on the beach but i figured just in case so that is officially everything for today i'm gonna go in the shower and try to get some editing done and then head out to the airport so i love you guys and i'll see you very soon in saint lucia bye